So are we now where Christ has led, following our exalted head. Made like him, like him we rise, ours the cross, the grave, the skies. Good evening, welcome to the Daily Office. Thank you for joining me. This is Night Prayer for Thursday, April the 24th. It's Easter Thursday. And the scripture for this service, Psalm 146, 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 41 to 50. Our help is in the name of God most high, the maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. O merciful God, we have sinned through our own fault in our thoughts and words and deeds and in what we have failed to do. We have not loved you with our whole hearts. We have not loved our neighbor as ourselves. We beseech you, overlook our faults and cast our sins behind your back, that we may serve you and praise you all the days of our lives. Amen. And may the Almighty and merciful God grant us forgiveness of all our sins and the grace and the comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O oh God, come to my assistance, make haste to help me. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God, O oh my soul. While I live, I will praise you. Hallelujah. Psalm 146. Hallelujah. Praise God, O oh my soul. While I live, I will praise you. I will sing praises to you while I have any being. Put not your trust in rulers, nor in the children of the earth, in whom there is no help. They die and return to the earth, in that very day their thoughts perish. Happy they that have the God of Jacob, Leah, and Rachel for their help, whose hope is in their God, who made heaven and earth, the sea and all that is in it, who keeps truth forever, and who executes judgment for the oppressed, and who gives food to the hungry. God sets the prisoner free. God opens the eyes of the blind. God raises those who are bowed down. God loves the righteous. God preserves strangers. God saves the orphan and widow. But the way of the wicked, God turns upside down. God shall reign forever, your God, O Zion, to all generations. Praise God. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God, O my soul. While I live, I will praise you. Hallelujah. A reading from Paul's first letter to the Corinthians, chapter 15, beginning at verse 41. There is one glory of the sun and another glory of the moon and another glory of the stars. Indeed, star differs from star in glory. So it is with the resurrection of the dead. What is sown is perishable. What is raised is imperishable. It is sown in dishonor. It is raised in glory. It is sown in weakness. It is raised in power. It is sown in a physical body. It is raised in a spiritual body. If there is a physical body, there is also a spiritual body. Thus it is written, the first man, Adam, became a living being. The last Adam became a life-giving spirit. But it is not the spiritual that is first, but the physical, and then the spiritual. The first man was from the earth, a man of dust. The second man is from heaven. As was the man of dust, so are those who are of the dust. And as is the man of heaven, so are those who are of heaven. Just as we have borne the image of the man of dust, we will also bear the image of the man of heaven. What I'm saying, dear brothers and sisters, is this. Flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of God, nor does the perishable inherit 
the imperishable. Here ends the lesson. Into your hands I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O God of truth. Keep us as the apple of your eye, hide us under the shadow of your wings. Our beloved which art in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, forgive us as we forgive others. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Let us pray. We praise you with all our being, Almighty God, for you defend us and save us because you love us. May we sing to you all the days of our lives. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Bless Jesus, my soul, and the almighty and merciful God, the source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us now and forever. Amen. Hallelujah. Happy Easter.